And Anu, we're getting this new alert from the sheriff because this sniper has stepped up his game this week. We're talking as many as 20 possible incidents since the end of July. That's an alarming number in and of itself. But three confirmed shootings, including two this week. And this is happening out here in a rural area. That makes this case even more difficult. Take a look at where we're talking about. I-94 in Calhoun and Eaton counties. And then I-69 south of I-94 into the Indiana state border and south of there. All three cases, we are told, trucks have been hit in their windows and metal sections. Nobody's been injured, but one of these happened yesterday, one on Wednesday. In other cases, some of the damage has been linked to just road debris, but several other cases are unknown. Now, if you're driving through this area, through this holiday weekend, to Chicago, Battle Creek, maybe tonight over to Kalamazoo for the Michigan State football game with Western Michigan, they are saying you do not need to change your route, but stay alert. Do not stop in the location the damage occurs. Uh, take a mental note of where you are on the freeway. Uh, also, if you have an opportunity, look around to see if you see anything there on adjacent roadways, a parked vehicle but continue on to the next exit ramp. The sheriff says then call 911. Now, we've talked to a lot of motorists from Metro Detroit coming through here. We're going to have their reaction coming up next hour at 5. Plus, we've been through this in Metro Detroit. We had a series of freeway shootings along I-96 back in 2012. How that is helping this case also next hour at 5. I'm live in Calhoun County, Jim Kurtzner. The now Detroit. All right, Jim, thank you so much. Well